canceling this show and kicking you all out without a refund. Okay. So if you all want to sit down and behave, feel free to enjoy the show. Yes, you read that title correctly. Movie theaters are now banning people in suits, and it's got something to do with TikTok and the new Minions The Rise of Gru. I'm your host, Johnny Rogers, and we're going to be getting into why this is all happening in today's edition of Comedy Breakdown. The Minions have been an insanely popular series for many years now, and it all started with the release of Despicable Me. The franchise has sparked thousands of viral memes and is now starting viral trends to drum up more hype than a Minion on a mission. This latest trend, though, is next level, and it's causing quite the disturbance at movie theaters. It has become particularly popular in the UK and sees large groups of people dressing up in suits or other formal attire and then attending a screening of Minions The Rise of Gru. Although, if that were all that happened, this would wouldn't be a story, now would it? You see, because clips of these large groups started to bring in millions of likes and views, the trend keeps taking bizarre turns in order to continuously up the ante. And whenever someone tries to outdo the last viral video, you know that chaos is imminent. We have seen this happen with virtually every other type of trending video. One Twitter user by the name of Kaniac Tyler actually uploaded an image of a sign that was posted on the doors of a movie theater warning against people participating in this trend. The sign reads, Due to recent disturbances following the hashtag gentle minions trend, any group of guests in formal attire will be refused entry for showings of minions the rise of Gru. Which is such a strange sign, but I guess when you have mass groups of teenagers moshing and cheering loudly inside of a movie theater for what is without question a kid's movie, they probably had to figure out a way to deal with all of this. What's hilarious to me though is the side effects that this sort of a sign will have. Imagine you're all dressed up for a different reason and then you decide, oh, let's go see a movie, only to be met with this sign. What I find funny about all of this though is the fact that movie theaters suffered so much throughout the pandemic and now that they're part of a viral trend, they don't want people coming into the theater anymore. Really? I understand that it may be a bit disruptive, but it's not like they're all sneaking in. I assume that everyone that participates in this challenge is buying tickets to the movie, so then what's the issue? Isn't that actually a really good thing? It's actually a miracle, if you ask me. You see, the new way to get mass groups of people to come out to your movie theater is no longer hyping it up to be this must-see blockbuster. Kids don't care about that. However, if you change the draw to be part of some massive viral trend that they get to now be a part of, you've now given them an incentive to come in. If anything, production companies and theaters should be working together on finding new ways to leverage these trends and then get those asses in the seats. Plus, letting this trend go where it goes is creating more comedic content and it's more advertising for your theater. It's literally free advertising. One video even shows a woman tricking her family into coming to watch the movie in formal dress after telling them that they were going to some fancy restaurant. I mean, the whole thing just makes for a more fun movie experience. Now, the one part I could do without is the throwing of bananas at the movie screen. At Cold Healing on Twitter said, Zoomers are throwing bananas at the screen during screenings of Minions Rise of Gru and getting entire theaters shut down, which then led to them being told that if they don't settle down, they'll be kicked out without a refund. Canceling this show and kicking you all out without a refund. Okay. If you all want to sit down and behave, feel free to enjoy the show. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Again though, instead of being foul and kicking these kids out with no refund, how about you just, I don't know, set up a bin for these kids to toss their bananas into? Then donate those bananas to the local zoo or something. There are so many better ways to handle this viral trend and I think there are just too many people that are so ready to rain on this minion parade. Does anyone like having fun anymore? Anyone? Bueller? Bueller? I mean, what happened to society where we were so scared of a TikTok trend and a bunch of bananas that we have to ban people from wearing suits? I'd love to hear your thoughts on all of this though because that's all the time that we have for today. But until next time, stay classy, YouTube.